Hey, it's Biddy Penny. Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great today. I have a dreams etc share for you. Oh my gosh. This is the May project sheet. This is the May box. I'm not sure if any of these are left in the shop or not, but the printables are always available. So these kits come with a ton of goodies. And then there's always a digital printable kit that comes with it too. The digital printable kit you can purchase separately. You don't have to purchase the subscription box for it. Um, and so that is still available. But I cannot wait to share this gorgeous, gorgeous box. So this is the only subscription I'm getting currently, and I'm just loving it so much. I started it at the beginning of the year, and I just love every single box. This one arrived on my birthday, and it was just decadent <laughs> and awesome. Okay, so this little envelope has some peel away washi stamps and then inside it had some um, book corners, um, it had some uh, that metal butterfly, a large clip and um, just some other goodies like brads and stuff in it. And then these are the stamps that come in this kit. I've already made a journal with this kit, you guys. As soon as I recorded this video for y'all, I was like, well, now it's time to make something. And I made a journal. So you'll see that tomorrow. I'm going to have that video out. But today, I just want to show you all the goodies. So it came with three little stamp sets, which are great and perfect for junk journaling or card making. These are all stickers and I had so much fun playing with these. Um, I know that Jen, the creator, the owner, the curator of this gorgeousness, um, she's recently fallen in love with stickers again. And so she made sure to put some in the last couple of boxes. And this is just a cute little box um, that you can fold up and it looks like a suitcase. How adorable is that? Just precious. Okay, there is so much to show you guys that I did have to speed this video up. It really honestly took me um, 25 minutes to unbox this and that's just how much stuff comes in this kit. So um, there are so many pieces of ephemera and paper and everything. There are videos uh, that Jen has on her um channel where she made that project she walks you through making that project look at this i think that's going to be gorgeous on the cover of a journal i love that these kits always come with lace and trim and it's just beautiful this is so lovely and it matches the kit perfectly that blue does and then I love that this piece has like a blue section a red and a pink section I think that is so cool and um yeah just very very beautiful laces and trims and I know that they can vary from box to box so if you subscribe and you've already gotten your box you may think oh my goodness my, my lace look completely different and I know they can vary um, everyone got a piece of this fabric though. That is gorgeous. Those flowers, ah, love them. So you guys, the journal I made is with this bag. So tomorrow, come back. I'll show you how to make a journal with a paper bag. And um, yeah, look at this upholstery fabric. I really like the back of it. And here is the front of it. Oh, it's so pretty. And I'm not sure, but I think Jen might have cut out some of the designs, but I could totally see doing that as well for like the focal point of a journal cover. Oh, it's just hard to pick the front or the back. Here is a little bag of ephemera. These kits, I was thinking about trying to bust this kit this month, but I don't even know. That's That would be a lot because I've already made a journal and I've barely made a dent in the kit. <laughs> I mean, barely. I bet you could make five journals from each one of these kits. And um, recently, the price of them did go down. Um, I mean, they're very reasonably priced, you guys, and such a treasure. 
an absolute treasure. So there's a bunch of ephemera. And you'll see some more of this, you know, more up close as I'm making things. Jen also has an unboxing. I'm going to leave her channel and some of her videos for this kit linked down below. I've seen a sneak peek of June and July and wow. And I think those are shipping out this week and there's a couple of them left. So you'll definitely want to go over and check that out. Um, at dreams, etc. So these are exclusive to her website. You know, she designs um, for multiple companies and she designs all of her artwork. It's not AI. It's not done by somebody else. She or her mom draws and designs all of the stuff. And I just think that's so amazing. These are some Prima journaling cards and they're just fun and beautiful. Then there's some tags and three sheets of stickers and another really cool tag. You guys, these tags are kind of pricey, I'll tell you. I've looked at them before and I never pull the trigger because they, they're costly. <laughs> so I'm always happy when she includes some of those in the kit. Here's a cool receipt. And what I love that she did this month was that she like printed on the receipts like what was in there and like thanks for your purchase, dreams, etc. It was just, she put so much thought into these, you guys. Look at these. These are like currency pieces that she's altered, but she prints them front and back. And I will tell you that the printables for last month for April and May were like that where they um, had front and back pages and I love that. It's so, so cool. Um, so here is some really pretty rice papers. I mean, gorgeous, just really, really beautiful. Love that. This page is so pretty. I really need to get some printable transparency sheets. I've been putting it off and I think this page has just pushed me over the edge. I'm going to have to order them because you can get some transparency pages that you print in like an inkjet. And then these gorgeous tea dyes with designs. So this is actual tea dyed paper. It's not a printed piece. And she tea dyes these herself and aren't they lovely? I haven't figured out how to do tea dyeing like that yet. I just do very basic stuff. So this envelope here and the airmail sheet of paper are the ones that are used for the project. If you're following along with a project, you would want to kind of pull these out separately so that you could use them for the project. And then these are really cool. I could see myself cutting these apart and creating kind of like labels with different sections and then this paper is just crinkly magic. I don't know what it is. It's tea dyed. I think it's parchment paper, baby. Ugh, it's incredible. An interdepartment <laughs> envelope. I laugh because we use these at work. So uh, awesome. Love having one of those. And then all of these gorgeous sheets of paper. And I love that Jen just go ahead. She just goes ahead and cuts it up for us. And I think that that is brilliant because you know how it is. You get a gorgeous piece of paper and you don't want to cut it. Well, guess what? These have already been cut, so it's time to use them. <laughs> I love that. And she cuts them in a way that they have so many uses. Like if you're a card maker, a junk journaler, whatever you do, there's multiple ways that you can use these sheets cut at these dimensions. It's just brilliant. I, I'm a big fan, okay? <laughs> um, and then I love these papers. So I'm trying to show you here that these are from lots of different Prima collections. It's not just one collection, which I also think is really, really cool because you're getting such a wide variety. Um, you're getting you know, select curated pieces from lots of different collections. And that is something that you normally can't get or do because you'd have to buy paper pads from all these different collections or buy individual sheets if they're available. 
Um, and so I like that. But she makes sure that they're all coordinated. They all go together beautifully. Like her kits really are curated with such an artistic vision, high quality products. I mean, this is the May kit and I'm showing it to you in August. So I will tell you like, don't get too attached to like your May kit coming in May. I know for some people it does. It's, it's kind of staggered out. Um, I think this kit is for people who just want these art supplies and can wait for them. Um, sometimes they're mailed out really quickly and sometimes they take a little bit of time. Um, so I would say, you know, if you sign up for the subscription, just know that you might need to be patient with the delivery of the kit, but you will get it and the art supplies are worth it. For me, it's worth the wait. I mean, I have so much in my stash that I'm never really needing <laughs> anything. I'm only wanting something. And so for me, it's just like this arrived on my birthday. The timing is always perfect for me somehow. And uh, I don't mind a little bit of a wait to get something that is so absolutely beautiful. Um, so I hope you enjoy this unboxing. I do have a gorgeous journal that's so easy to make that I'm going to show y'all tomorrow. I want to show you now just a little bit of the printables. And why I say a little bit is I printed a couple of pages of the different variety, like all these different dolls. Um, but there is so much more. And I think I like to leave that surprise for you. Um, I don't want to show you every single page because I want you to be surprised. So here's what I was talking about earlier with the front and back. So this takes time, um, but she designs it so you could print it front and back and have these really beautiful pieces. I wanted to print these separately so you could see exactly what I'm talking about. This snippet page is fantastic. Um, it's a bunch of labels. And so I just went ahead here and just kind of cut these apart. And immediately, you know, you kind of have uh, like a snippet roll of labels that you could use the whole piece in a design. You can cut these apart and use them individually. I just think that's fun. Gorgeous flowers. Um, gorgeous paper dolls, gorgeous everything always with Jen's printables. Definitely go check out Dreams, etc. I'm going to leave it linked down below. I'm going to leave Jen's channel linked down below. And Jen, thank you so much. I absolutely love this box. All right. Thanks so much for watching, guys. See you next time.